All right, so at two o'clock, you want to go in the stock pot in. It's two o'clock now, and you're going to talk to Andrew, that's the name of this woman, as a Goron. Um, did you have a reservation? Say yes. I did. You do have a reservation, that's good. Mr. Link, is it? One moment, please. Mr. Link, I'd be down for an afternoon arrival. Your room is our knife chamber on the second floor. Here's your key. Alright, so technically you don't have to get this key, it just makes things a lot easier. You don't have to take the entrance above the inn as a Deku, you can just go through the bottom entrance whenever you want. In my opinion, it's just easier. Plus, I'm pretty sure, yeah, you need that for the notebook. Uh, please relax. You're also going to want to talk to her while we're in the cafe mask. After she receives this letter. You're also looking for Cafe? I have a request. Cafe, I have a clue that will help you find him. Tonight at 11.30. Please come to our kitchen. We'll talk then. Which is what I'm going to do. So, we, I believe, cannot do anything until that time, so I'm gonna wait. I'll play the song double time first, though. Actually, you know what? First, I'll show you what's in this room. Since I don't think we really have a use for going in here any other time. So, here's our room. And guess, guess what it has in it? Yep, a chest with 100 rupees. Pretty nice, huh? Anyway, yeah, see you guys at uh, 11.30. First night. Alright, so after waiting for Andrew, we can talk to her in the kitchen. I'm sorry to trouble you late at night. It's about him, Cafe. I received a letter from him. Strange, isn't it? Getting a letter from a missing person? But there's absolutely no mistaking it. It's from him. It's clear to me. Please. Here's my letter. Please put this in, an, in a post box. When this is delivered, when he receives my letter, you should be able to meet him. Please tell him that Andrew is waiting for him. And please, after you've seen him, tell me how he looked. <laughs> I'm scared. I I can't go. Can I ask this of you? Yes. Do not say no. <laughs> Thank you very much. Boom. Letter to Cafe. Quick, deliver it for, for her. Take it to a mailbox. Please mail it immediately in the morning. And so we shall. Um... I can just play the song of double time, no need uh, in cutting this part out. So I'm gonna go outside. Boom shakalaka, ma dudes. Oh yeah, I can also show this off. So since we took this guy's key, since this guy's actually Mr. Link, and we're just going, damn Goro, tomorrow's rain Goro, Goro, Goro. <laughs> yeah, this Goron's name is actually Link. I think it's a nod to, um, Ocarina of Time, where there's a Goron named Link that was named after you. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be it. Anyway, we want to mail this letter, which we won't need the Goron mask anymore, so. Okay, I have to deposit mail here. Yes. Your letter has been received. It shall be delivered tomorrow. You sent the letter. Awesome. Now, we're gonna have to wait until 3 p.m. the next day. By we, I mean me, because you guys won't have to wait, because... Ta-da! Alright, so we see this dude mailman running around at the speed of sound. He's gonna ring this bell here, in the laundry pool. Cafe's gonna go out, and when he goes out... You want to go in this house. <laughs> Boom, we did it. Awesome. So now we're in Cafe's little hideout place. He's got a bed, a 
door, a thing here. So we just gotta wait for him to come back in. This is a, a lot of fun waiting. So it's maybe a short video for you guys, but for me, this is the longest video to record thus far. Like I've already spent probably 20 minutes waiting. <laughs> just kidding, that's an exaggeration. Green hat, green clothes. Angie wrote about you in her letter. It seems you are looking for cafe. Can you keep a secret? Um, yes. And you trusted you. I shall also trust you. <gasps> I am cafe. <laughs> I'm so shocked. The cafe we're looking for is an adult. When I look at you, I just see a child. I was turned into this by a strange imp wearing a mask. That skull kid is just getting around everywhere. But I'm not hiding because I look this way. When I was turned into this, I went to see the great fairy in the shrine near the north gate. But on the way, my precious mask, a wedding ceremony mask, was stolen from me by some prancing man with a grinning face. Sakon, you ass. Well, you're just careless. You're like my partner. Wow, thanks, frickin' cattle. Before my wedding ceremony, I was quite happy. I was targeted because of what I had been turned into. Oh my, I pity you. <laughs> Tattle's just a jerk. I know Angie was worried, but I can't go out yet. I made a promise to her that I would bring the wedding mask and greet her. This pendant, give it to Angie. You accepted the pendant of memories. Though you may not understand these grown up matters, you should probably take the pendant to Andrew anyway. Keep what we just talked about a secret from everyone. The Mysterious Youth Cafe. You've been entrusted with a precious item. This is added to your notebook. Um, oh yeah, if you talk to him again, you can actually... Things that get stolen in this town always make their way to the curiosity shop. I'm waiting for that to happen. Stand on that crate and peek into that hole. So you can actually... You can look through the hole into the curiosity shop. Which, currently there's no one there. But, yeah. Sakon sold, or stole, steal stuff and gives it to that curiosity shop guy. Um, so we're not gonna make a cut just yet because I actually have to go deliver a letter. Or not a letter, a pendant. We will have to deliver another letter though. That isn't over. Well, it sort of is. I don't know. Whatever. Forget it. But after we give her this pendant, I'm gonna have to wait until 12 p.m. on the third day. And that... That is correct. Also, I should probably hurry up because I'm pretty sure I need to do this before... 6 p.m. And it's almost that time. So, I should really go fast. Here she is. Speak. Oh, did you meet him? Here you go. Ah, it's from Cafe. Thank you very much. That face looks so happy. This is add to your notebook. Anyway, now we've got some more waiting to do. I'm going to wait until 12 p.m. on the third day. Peace out.